Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Eternal Father, we thank you for life. We thank you for being Nigerians. We thank you for bringing us together. And that's where we are at. We know our intentions. That we have wandered over the years and lost leadership. We have gathered that we have someone whom we hope will lead us in the near future. Bless our events, bless our conversations, and give us the leeway to cap it up by making it come 2022 to the glory of God. of the United Kingdom and the national item of the Federal Republic of Nigeria.
Let's put our hands together. Clearly, many of you left Nigeria a very, very good. You have forgotten it. Uh, 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 don't worry. When His Excellency Pitobi becomes the President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, you will be excited again to sing that with your heart and your soul. It is well. Change is coming. Amen. Ladies and gentlemen, at this juncture, we would like to we would like to invite you officially, or to say, you are at the UK Coalition Summit with His Excellency, former Governor of Nampa State, Peter Gregory Obi, with the topic we are looking at today, the role of Nigerians in the diaspora in the political, economic, and social development of Nigeria. Many people have been the reason why this event and the other events that have taken place. So just before we get lost in what His Excellency will say and other people, we just want to very quickly recognize all the organizations that made this event, other events happen. We'd like to recognize obedient and useful Nigerian diasporas UK. Come on, let's put our hands. In fact, we can clap for everybody at the end because of time. Doctors for Peter Obi UK, Peter Obi Vanguard Ambassadors, Diaspora for Obi Dati, Peter Obi Presidential Global Network, Obi Dati Support Group UK, Nigerian Diasporans for Peter Obi, Nigerian Diasporans for Democratic Governance, Diaspora Strong for Peter Obi, Nigerian Leadership Search UK. Come on, let's keep those hands going. And of course, people, Peter Obi Global Concept, the POGC. Nurses for Peter Obi, Frontliners for Peter Obi UK, Obi Data Diaspora Group, keep it coming, keep it coming. Diaspora Medics for Good Governors, Nigeria's Diaspora Action Group, the NDAG, Association of Evil State for Peter Obi UK Chapter, Obedient Movement UK, United Coordinator, Obedient, and Yusuf. for the sweat, people are using their own money, their own resources, their own time. Come on, one more time, let us put our hands in and appreciate everybody that has made this us, happen. We do know people, they say the voice of the people is the voice of God. When children, women, and even men have decided to be on this bad wagon, you know it's a good thing. Very quickly, we're going to invite His Excellency very soon. We're changing around the program. I don't want anybody to be offended with me, so let me give honor very, very quickly. We would like to recognize the presence of Councillor Gloria Hopper, member for Princess Park Road. Can we put our hands together for her? Councillor Gloria Hopper would also like to recognize the presence of Her Excellency Ambassador, Councillor Caroline Kano. She's a Peace Ambassador for the UN from Lumishun. We would also like to recognize, I don't need notes for this one, Double Mayor, Her Worshipful, Kate Anno, Dr. Kate Anno, Double Mayor from the London Borough of Enfield. Thank you so much. Anything else we miss out, we shall come back to it. We also like to recognize the presence of the Labour Party Chairman, not UK Labour Party, Nigeria. Labour Party, Barrister Julius Abre. Come on, let's put our hands. And of course, graciously joining us here today, we would also like to recognize a celebrity and um, someone who has moved from the United Kingdom to Nigeria. She made wave, she shook the entertainment industry. Ladies and gentlemen, Wayne we MC is here with us today. Please get up and take a bow. Thank you. Somebody that has been traveling with His Excellency 
be contested for the Anambra partnership election under the PDP. Now a member of the Lady Prime. Come on, let's put our hands together and appreciate our senior brother, Valentine Osibo, who is also here. Come on, let's appreciate him. Let's put our hands together. All right. Would you like to introduce... Hey, just a minute. I, um, uh, something was... She left. wants to introduce his excellency, so... <laughs> Okay, so we do also have a Peter B support network from Ireland, as a matter of fact. Let us Come on, let's put our hands together all the way from Ireland. Oh, look at them, they're fully represented. Beautiful. Thank you so much for coming. Thank you for coming. Okay, people, Nigerians are desperate for change. And it's about time for that change to come about. We have heard about change. As a matter of fact, we have actually gone to the, which of the dictionaries to check the real meaning of change, but it didn't tally. But this time around, we believe it will, and sure it will. Today, we have found the one that Nigerians are calling the Messiah. Peter Obi, many say, is a credible, alternative to the status quo. <laughs> Undoubtedly the most, the most popular presidential candidate that we have seen in Nigeria's history ever. <laughs> it is with great honor, with my able colleague, Beside me, will I introduce the former governor of Anambra State, who is now the presidential candidate of the Labour Party, His Excellency Peter Obi. To a you're welcome, sir.